Activities for tiny churches. What do adults and children do in little home gatherings? In tiny churches, you must not try to hold religious services as they do in big churches where they have skilled musicians, trained leaders, and a passive audience. In the tiny churches of the New Testament, Jesus' apostles introduced four kinds of activities. They devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching and the fellowship to the breaking of bread and the prayers. Following the apostolic model, we recommend that you lead tiny churches in any of the following activities. Activities of regular gatherings. Gather at a quiet, safe place where you arrange seating in a circle such that everyone can see all of the others. Clear starting and ending times. The worship time starts when someone places bread and cups on a central table. The time ends when someone removes these from that table. Praise, joyful songs, expressions of thanks to God. Provide examples for others to follow. Mutual confession of faults and failures, without describing the details, with silent confession of sins to God. The Lord's Table, allowing all to serve the elements to one another. Afterwards, declare that God has forgiven all confessed sins. Testimonials of recent experience with God, of spiritual victories, and of answers to prayer. Requests for prayer. As anyone expresses a need or a request, have others pray for it immediately before someone else shares a request. Discovery Bible Study. Read a text together, ask questions about it, and let each one present share observations and applications. Share plans for service opportunities during the coming week and pray one for another. Activities between regular gatherings Leaders plan together occasional activities for some or all of those who participate in regular activities. Here are some examples. Short courses and seminars picnics and socials, visits and outreach to the needy, coaching of new leaders, baptisms, weddings or funerals, prayer vigils. Activities for children in regular gatherings. Young children who cannot participate in adult discussions or who would prove disruptive should have some activities apart from the adults and other activities with them. Children's monitors prepare them to present memorized activities to the adults. Activities for children apart from adults. Learn Bible stories and teaching. Sing, dance, and worship. Memorize Bible verses. Practice acting out Bible stories, manual arts, pray one for another and bless one another. Activities for children together with adults. Recite memorized Bible verses, sing memorized songs, act out a Bible story, pose queries to the adults about the Bible story show their manual arts, pray for the adults and bless them. Then let the adults pray for the children and bless them.